Hello everyone, welcome back to JJ TV. I hope you're all doing well and in today's video, um, it's gonna be a bit of a short one, but it's gonna be good as well because you get to see my Fiesta ST200, which is just here. Um, it looks okay-ish on camera, but it's actually really disgusting um, day-wise. It hasn't been cleaned in probably like two or three months since we've moved house and everything. Um, but my good friend Connor over here with his little work van, um, he's a car detailer and does loads of stuff like that, ceramic coats and whatever else comes along with it. And he is going to be, yeah, doing a nice quick, well, it's not quick, but he's doing a proper clean on it. He's not doing any detailing as such, but that is in a new video to come soon because um, we are going to get it detailed. Uh, and then you guys can go to him if you need it as well. Um, but yeah, I'm going to give you a little walk around of the car anyway to show you kind of the state of it because uh, it's absolutely disgusting. And then we'll do like some of the in-process sort of shots and then after it's finished as well. Right, we're walking around the see, look at this. I don't know how much detail you can see, but these wheels are absolutely filthy. And uh, like if I put my finger here, I can't really see much, but look at the amount of dirt that's just come off. The brake calipers are meant to be bright red. Yeah, there's, they are disgusting. I also do need some new tyres. Um, they are due soon as well. Uh, but to be fair, these are done good. They've lasted me since new, and I've done 23,000 miles in them. So yeah, it's done a good job. Uh, but yeah, you can just tell the car is completely filthy. You know, bug splats everywhere, you've got dust, because where we've just moved to, um, they're doing a lot of building work, so all the dust that they're doing just gets chucked up onto the windscreen, all over the car. So the car is absolutely filthy, it's just coated with dust, and you know, it's just like sizzling all the dirt off it. I can't really, it's just turning everything green, really. So this is pretty much just a metal cleaner. It's just look at it, it's just like getting all the just, green stuff off. Just, well, all the dirt. Just, and it wants to actually focus, which is nice. It doesn't scratch the paint apparently. Okay. So <laughs> it just makes it look all cool and spongy. I don't know why, but when your car is like covered in like white soaky foam, it just looks cool. Well, I find it cool anyway. I don't know why everyone else thinks, but it just looks fine, especially with the storm grey behind it. Like the colours showing again for the first time, and I don't know how long because. I kind of neglected the cleanliness in my car. Inside's fine, except the outside is needed down. So we're going to get it on it with a ceramic coat as well soon and uh, some other detailing bits. Uh, if any of you guys do want uh, your car detail, then Connor is a man to go to. He does work for a company as well that deals with like Mercedes and do all their cars for when they have stands at events, etc. So he knows exactly what he's doing. And he is mobile as well, as you can tell from the van, so he can come to your location. Um, and we'll do your car for you for a, a cheaper price than what it would cost you to go into a garage and have it done by a, a company based at a warehouse of some sort. Plus it saves you the hassle of having to get there because they come to you. Even though we've gone over it twice now, you can still see the dirt coming off of it from the sponge. Uh, obviously that's what the power washer didn't get off at its first run, but this brush uh, apparently works wonders, so 
hopefully on the next run of using the power washer it will come off. It just looks so cool, especially with the sun glaring on it as well. Wash it all off again. After the it away. So we'll wash it all off again then. And hopefully it comes out nice and shiny. I'll show you some cool little videos. Here. Now chrome again, yeah, because it was filthy and black last time. Uh, I haven't seen it looking nice and shiny and chrome for so so long. That looks good. The glove is clay bath to help get the uh, tar and any shit off the paint. Ah, okay. So it basically, gets all the stuff the power washer can't get off on the brush, like tar that may come up off the road and glue to your car. Which there is a spectacle over here. I don't know where is it. There is a spectacle of tar just here. That little black bit there, I don't know if you can see it, it's just like the... And you can't get it off, but apparently this magical glove can. So, hopefully it will. See if it gets it. Oh look, it's gone. It has disappeared. The magical glove of wonders. It's foul, it's a gentle to do. Um, so yeah, I'll show you what it looks like after it's finished. But, you know, it looks really, really good already. So hello everyone, I um, hope you're all well, thanks for watching the previous part of the video. Um, I just want to let you guys know that for some strange reason I was recording it on my iPhone and the audio got corrupted from the point after you've just seen. Um, but that pretty much was the car just getting clean, so I'm going to showcase to you now uh, some after pictures of what it looks like. We took some nice pictures on our phone, so I'll show you then. Um, but yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Uh, let me know if you want to see some more stuff like this. Um, sort of daily sort of vlog life um, with the car and stuff like that and let me know what you guys think down below and if you did enjoy this video leave it a nice big thumbs up because we all like a clean car don't we it looks disgusting well, it did look disgusting now it looks great um, so yeah I want to thank Connor for that if you do want to go and um, get anything from him uh, his link will be in the description of this video just give him a shout on Instagram or something I'm sure he will come to uh, come to you to get your car cleaned or detail it whatever you kind of want to do but yeah I hope you guys enjoyed um, make sure you hit that subscribe button if you are new around here and want to keep up to date with what we do uh, but yeah thanks for watching guys I'll catch you in the next one uh